what's good friends we got more OEPL we got Pearl versus um, this guy got subbed in let me know his let me check his name real quick I think Sam many brolic said something like that subbing in Sam for teal so this is Sam over here and this is Pearl I assume got that disgusting shinies he had shinies last time too yeah he has some bulky offense with Mega Scizor which one is a uh the game is the meat meat physical yeah meat versus meat physical is pearl versus sam oh yeah disgusting team disgusting team which one the <laughs> the tangro the mono <laughs> um yeah we got team the call you, you guys might see hear him later he might do a guest upload like tomorrow or like i might upload it like the next day so if he does it today because i have enough Good. content for the day so yeah if i look at his team he just scarf kelios like yeah, probably. It's just Volt Turn and this is like Scarf killed plus Volt Turn. Cause like he loses to Volcarona if it's not Scarf killed. Yeah, I mean, I was saying like I, th me and Sadarts were watching a game and we were like, this guy loses because he was not Scarf Greninja. I, I can see it. I can. Do you think it's Spikes Ash Grin or do you think it's U Turn? I'm thinking it's definitely like Ash Spikes. Greninja. Like Spikes for sure. He doesn't have Hazard Control on his own. So that way he can yeah. punish opposing defogs. Uh, like I guess it, force. Could, it could be protein because Tapu Fini's like. Yeah, I don't know if it's protein or ash, but it's spikes for sure. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah, it's ash. ash, so probably big spikes. Unless it's the taunt set. Actually, no, 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 he wouldn't be taunt on spikes. So yeah, the Tangles can go either for Giga Drain predicting the Medicham or knockoff predicting the Jirachi. Get H, you get HP ice here. I mean, the Medicham is pretty. F Okay, maybe it's not free. Um, so like he's either going Jirachi, manage him or Landris here. So, he's the, hmm. I would probably um, this this Greninja is pretty important. So I don't think yeah, he's he's kind of forced to switch. Yeah, I probably guess this, not. The all of them safe place. I don't know. Giga Drain or knockoff here. I think it's. I the because his Lele just like tears him apart. Yeah, so if we see leftovers, we see leftovers, so it's not Z move. Oh, Z move Coco, Z move Lando. So, Spadef Rachi, uh, Scarf Kill. Oh, I guess maybe the Lando could be like Z move then. Yeah, that's, the what I w that's what I wanted to say, because like, he's kind of weak to stall. Probably Continental yeah. Crush. Uh, it could be. He's using a team that's like. This team is like pretty common. It's like the same build, just different mods sometimes. He could be he could be SmackDown Lando too with off play. We saw that earlier. They're like that's good versus stall. Either sub SD Landris or like just SD Landris with SmackDown and Rocks and Earthquake. Let me put up the volume a bit. He were a bit low earlier. He has trouble switching into this Tangro. Surprisingly. You think he's going for knockoff right here? He, he can go Medicham if he plays He should definitely knock off here. Because this Rachi is like super annoying for Nihiligo and the Scizor, the Lottie. Yeah, I'll probably go Medicham here. Unless he's unless he's supersonic sky stroke Lando and he goes into Landris on a knockoff. That would... I, I'd go I'd go Landris or Medi. Yeah, yeah. I was about to say, like, it depends on the Z move. Like, if he's fly Z, he could go Lando. But yeah, let me open the Kalk. I don't know if uh, High Jump Kick kills AV Tang from there. Oh, definitely. Um, you think gonna eat this? I just like to back it up with Kalk because sometimes I was wrong. High Jump Kick to 78 to 93 if it's Adamant. Okay. This Tangro is about to leave the screen. He has no switch ins. He I can know. go Landers. I mean, yeah, like, he can go Landers, but he doesn't have to, ice punch. He doesn't have to predict. I think high jump kick is pretty much fine. Yeah. You never sack Tangro here. Like. Yeah, Tangles is important for the Greninja and it checks the Keldeo, like, and it was the... It's important for, like, half the team. Yeah, the Coco, too. And it also kind of checks the Rachi. The Lando, if it's if it's not Z-Fly Lando, the Tangles kind of walks the entire team. Goes hard, Lottie. 
Um, Van. Scarf Lady or Scarf Nihiligo? Not 100% sure. Probably Scarf Nihiligo. Hmm. Yeah, he can defog or he could like the Jirachi can come in here. Or he can recover if he breaks the switch. I think he's defog. I would, I would say it's probably Scarf Nihiligo as well. Double without breaking Jirachi. Nice play. So. If this is Icy Wind Jirachi, that would be cool to see, but I don't think it is. I think it's U turn Iron Head, Stealth Rock Healing Wish. Uh, instead of Stealth Rock, it could have Fire Punch, but he's not that weak to Scissor. No. And probably Healing Wish. So I think we're gonna see rocks from the Landris, and. He brings, hard the, la brings the Lander hard in. So let me see. He's either gonna SD here into like Z move. Either that or rocks. Or hard HPIs. I don't think he has HPIs on land or I think he has HPIs on Jirachi. Like, I'm not sure. At first I thought he had on land though. Like, what would you have on you U turn Iron Head, Healing Wish? What else would you have on Jirachi? Oof. Okay, so we see it's not Helmet Lando and the SD kinda. Makes me think that it's a Z move, Lando. Yeah. He's so, kind of like forced into Keldeo slash Ninja here. The other option I was thinking is like Z Outer Zygarde if this Landris was not Z move. Yeah, he go, um. He can go Greninja on Spike here, like if he's aggressive. Um, I mean, Keldeo can also fish for a burn on, on the Tangrowth. Well, the spikes kind of fucks his team, and his Lottie is really low. So yeah, Lottie, Lottie can't come in on, on if he went Kalia too. If he he can go Lottie if he predicts a spike, but like you don't want to give him the Ash from, so you just go Tangros here. That's always the play. I agree. So I would probably spike. He predict the the Tangros. <laughs> I mean, you can just go for Dark Bolts or Hydro too, but like. I don't think Hydro Hydro no, Hydro I loses. Think, I think he'll spike here. Hydro he'll loses your momentum, kinda. And then the obvious Tangerus comes in. Yeah, yeah. At least he makes that mid ground play I like that play, because that does some chip. I said chip, but if he gets one flinch, just Tangerus is dead. But he's obviously not risking it. I think he's going for Giga Drain here, not risking a flinch. Yeah. Like, not risking the Greninja staying in, is what I meant. Yeah, Jirachi can... Try to Iron Head flinch just in case the Tangus tries to stay in. But I assume we're gonna see the Scissor slash the Landris come out here. To get the Regenerator back. Hmm. Like, he can go for rocks if he has them. But what did the Landers? The Landers showed U-turn only. I think it's default scissor the way he brought it in. He wants to keep up momentum. Um, I feel like Pod Steam's like kinda weak to stall, so I could see Scarf Trick Lottie. Even though yeah. even though Nihiligo makes more sense because unless it's the Nihiligo is like the bulky spread to live HP ground from Volcona. If it's not Scarf, it has to be the bulky spread that lives one, plus one HP ground. Um, if he has but death on Scissor, he can even stay in. I mean, it's risky, but like... If he doesn't get burned... I don't think he can stay in, because... I mean, the Tangrowth is free, but like, the Tangrowth is so good in this matchup, I don't know if you want to let it get burned. Like, Scissor... Scissor Loses to most. What would you stay in to do though? You you don't do no damage. I mean, you you turn or you defog. Probably you turn. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I know, I know it sounds kind of bad, but like if the Tangles gets burned, it was the entire team, so I don't think he would go Tangles. Yeah, exactly. That's what I meant. Did you turn there? So not going Lali there makes him think he's not Scarf Lali. Oh, he just wants his Tangrowth in because it's like really walling everything now. And yeah, you know the Keldeo's locked into 
Hydro Pump probably, so he can't even burn this. Probably gonna see a knockoff here, slash... Slash... Uh, HPS. Yeah, knockoff. I probably try to flinch this once, because he's not gonna knock off again here, expecting the U-turn. Kids wish, so it's not healing wish. So that move could be protect. Iron head and protect. That's kind of weird, because his team looks so offensive, so I thought this would be healing wish and not wish. Do you think um, he'll switch on and protect here? Mm. I could see um, the scissor coming out, or I could see the... Lando slash Zygarde. It's, he definitely has to pr Whoa. Wait. I mean, Why would you not protect there? The Jirachi doesn't die to... Um, doesn't die to rocks. Yeah, it's, it doesn't... Yeah, it doesn't heal up on anything, but getting getting Mage in basically gets a kill. He has to sack either the Lali or the Scizor. I forgot the Lali was at 20-something, so... Um, I, still, I, understand the like, I don't think you more. risk Landris here. And you have Landorus for Nihiligo, so Rachi's just kind of not important anymore, I guess. I mean, I understand that. I like. I might have protected there, but having Medicham in is like great at full health. Yeah, it gets a kill. Yeah, I just read um on the Smogon wall, but. An actual 10th Smogon wall that he's maybe he will get subbed out. Jay Stays was at a gym and he's like coming home in a bit because it's like super late and in Spain where Axel 10 is living, it's 1 30 a.m. But yeah, he decides to take off the scissor as he does ice punch there. I don't think he had to make that play. I can understand it, but like this, the Ladio scissor sack is kind of obvious, so now he can. I don't know how much you value health on he the won't, Medichim. He won't pivot out because the scissor dies to spikes. How much How much do you value health on Medichim? Like, is it worth to bullet... Oh, is it worth to... Is it worth to switch out on a potential roost and not take the bullet punch, or...? Like, the Medichim at full means that you can come in on Tangrowth. If you take a bullet... You live, if you take... You live like one hit from everything no, no. to... Like, if you take a bullet punch, like, Giga Drain almost killed. It doesn't kill, but, like, brings you so low. Oh, yeah, Andy was playing with his poges, and... Andy lost, it seems, for Circle Jerk to semifinals, but, yeah, I didn't record that. Just <laughs> showing you guys the result real quick. Yeah, okay, so that I can get that play, yeah. What was that Thunder Punch play to like assert dominance? I don't know. Thunder Punch was, I had no idea. If he goes hard and he'll go there for some reason to get the para, I don't know. But they would never go nearly go there, I don't know. Oh yeah, someone was like, I should bring the birds back. And yet he always has the birds in the background. So yeah, they're back. The birds are here. <laughs> the bad talent flame is not here anymore in OU. <laughs> So yeah, I doubt that I doubt this has bullet punch. The last move fake out probably. If if Medi if Dianthi was out already, I would say it may might be bullet punch. But he can sack the Jirachi here. Yeah. I could see a recover if this, if this has if it has recover, it would be a pretty cool play. Yeah. Okay. Shadow Ball. Is this probably Z move? That's probably the Z Shadow Ball to to Lu and Tapu Lele. That's a cool set. That's a set. I was playing around with that set in a team builder, and I was like <laughs> wondering if. I mean, it sounds it was, cool. Yeah, definitely. It looks kind of cool on paper. All, all you hit. Yeah, is you're just a dark pull here. Yeah. Hmm. 
Yeah, so Tango's back in and, and forced to Giga Drain here. This, this Astro Ninja just wins if, yeah, he's definitely forced to Giga Drain here. I mean, the Jirachi is gone, so he has no Giga Drain resist. It should do like 30%, 35 maybe. Okay, okay only that's 27. So that probably makes HP Lander then. Oh, my Kalks are just completely off. He got his rocks up. Hmm. So meet, meet, the meat guy is going to U-turn our HP eyes here. I don't, I don't think the Tangrows can switch back in on the Greninja. Yeah, yeah, the, the spikes the plus rocks makes it like really the tough. The Greninja gets the kill. Yeah, he has to try and defog, but he doesn't defog on anything besides Lando, I think. On or on the Medicham that all that already used up the fake out. Unless he's scarf Lady, then he also defogs and other stuff. A well played Zygarde can maybe pull this back because this Lando is getting pretty weak. I mean Zygarde can like Dragon Dance on Coco if it's not HP eyes. Yeah. But if it's not if HP it's eyes, it's probably taunt, yeah. so. Sex that with was Coco on the Z what? move? Oh, never mind, he breaks the Z fly. I don't know if he predicted that or if he was just sacking. He probably was sacking it, because looking at the team, there's multiple, multiple electric resists. But yeah, HP is on. It's an HP ice off here. HP is on HS Madness, I assume. Can make I could see um, Nihiligo coming in, or because he's like the Tangrowth, if it gets U turned on, then Greninja gets a kill. Kind of, well, no, it doesn't, I guess. It depends on how much it comes in at and how much the U turn. The Tangrowth, it comes in on uh, at like 90 something, and it takes rocks, so it's gonna be at like 81 or 82. Okay. So I guess, I guess Tangrowth is. A safe play so after here. U turn, it will be at like 70. You can, you can Earthquake also predicting U turn and living HP ice. I mean, if HP ice kills the Koku, that's also not potential play here. Because this Lando does nothing, kind of. It dies from Grin and Keldeo. It It doesn't have its Z move no more, so it's walled by the other Landorus. But he saves it. Yeah, yeah, that's a potential fodder for later. Wait. Did I say it comes in on healthy? Yeah, what the fuck? Did regenerate and not activate or did I like miscall? Well, oh yeah. I think I didn't miscalc because it come it, yeah, it, yeah, 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 yeah. I only I only I was only cutting rocks. I didn't think about spikes. Yeah, yeah my bad. So yeah, high jump kick gets a kill here. That doesn't want to miss. Okay, it doesn't want to let the Lando come in. So yeah, Ice Punch was probably was the best play there. Cause that, like, you, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you don't want to miss, and it kills everything. This Nihiligo is pretty threatening, though. Like Ice Punch, it can actually sweep. If he weakens the Lander, is actually doesn't this Kelly this Nihiligo just win? I think it just wins because the Landorus has been weakened. You just gotta maybe weaken the Keldeo a tad bit more, but if you get the plus one, I don't think it matters. Yeah, so Sludge Wave is the play slash. If you break the land or your HP Ice here, or Power Gem. I don't think you have the HP Ice. You can just Sludge Wave. I mean, this, Nih this Nihiligo is gonna end up sweeping. So he gets a Beast Boost here. Okay. Oh, but it's a Speed Boost. It's the Spec Set. Ooh. I mean that's like that's like the same. That's like it's scarf, like kinda. Not it's not the same, but, but it's it's like, get out special. Get out special. Never mind. I'm bet. Yeah, yeah, you're right. It does get out sped by Kelly. Yeah. I I thought Nihilik was 109 speed, but it's 100. This sludge wave should kill, right? Or no, no, no. I'm I mean, he has to hydro pump to kill this. I think. I don't think scald kills. Oh, secret, yeah, scald, secret, scald scald, secret scald might kill. Yeah, because the Hilligo. But you can scald here because the fake out should kill if scald after the scald. The Hilligo has pretty bad defense, so secret scald probably kills. I 
I wish they would play a little bit faster because we have like some other games coming up soon. I don't want to miss them. I don't want to miss the start. Okay, hydro pumps because Scott wasn't killed in Illegal. Yeah, he clicks Giga Drain again here. So he kind of has to. He's probably gonna sack the Lando or. Because the Kelio prevents the Nihiligo from sweeping, kinda. Also, also the Greninja has water shrinking, so the Nihiligo is getting super low after the next tethered round. Probably sack the Lando here, and then Medicham gets another kill, I think. I like how he's using the Specs Nihiligo as like his speed control. Uh, it's like 80 HP and 176 attack investment, so you get the speed boost instead of the special attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah but he also has um, he also has bullet punch, e speed, and he has a bulky core. Yeah, and the hill go. Oh, he's timing out soon. Yeah, yeah so Hydra gets a kill here as long as it hits. Um, yeah, if Ice Punch kills, you can go for Ice Punch, because Ice Punch obviously kills Nihiligo after Hazards. But yeah, I, don't, I haven't run the Kalk, but I assume Ice Punch might kill two. And Nihiligo got sacked off, and... I don't think Paul can win this one. Hmm. Um, you have... Let's see. This you is, have the same This is Bandit, this is Bandit right? Or do you think it's drain then? I think it's banded. I think you have. Hmm. It's probably banded, yeah, looking at the team. Like, Ice Punch just. Or it's, it is banded. So is he forced to E speed then? So Ice Punch kills. It's so intriguing, Yeah, okay, okay, that should be 2 key on the Kalio. Yeah. And the Greninja should be. Um, dang, the Greninja is, might be a roll. I think Zygarde wins. Did he just choke? I can count for you guys how much um, Greninja takes. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that freaking... That E-Speed is like a roll. I know why he went hard kill, you know. You know, man, there's some background noises going on. Oh, bad. No, that's fine. Sixty-four percent. Uh, Zygarde. Adamant. It should kill, right? It does, fif it it does fifty-seven to sixty-eight, so it's oh. a roll. And well, it's probably well, slightly in the good ninja's favor, I think. <laughs> so, you didn't want to risk the roll there. You want the ninja, you want the ninja. I think you have the dark pulse flinch here. No, he hydro pumped. Yeah. I think it's over now. Giga Ring gets a yeah, kill. Yeah, the mage dies after rocks. I think he should have. He should have dark pulse there. Yeah, and Eastbeat kills the mage in one hundred percent now. If he switched the Greninja out, Eastbeat also killed that, so he had to stay in, I guess. And like, I can call how much Eastbeat does to manage him, but I'm like hundred percent sure it killed. Yeah. It does fifty-two to sixty-one. So yeah, Pearl takes the win, and I think this is the I think this guy Sam is on Manny Brodick's team, and he lost. So Top Tier Boy has to beat Ricardo to make the score four and four for Manny Brodick's team. So that's gonna be tough. Should be easy for Top Tier Boy. <laughs> what? <laughs> He's gonna the get goat. blown away. The uh, goat. I look at the score real quick, just to make sure that I didn't say anything wrong. Oh, Peter replied to the threat. So. 
What did he say? Did he say someone got subbed out? Let me read that. But yeah, yeah the, got... hype this, hmm? the hype for this Ricardo match is real though. Yeah, yeah it's like the last game besides the Axel 10 J Stays game. Oh, this guy said, can you maybe post replays P2? It's kinda impossible to find replays when people use random ass emojis or play on dumb edgy ass names. Yeah, like I was about to say, you can check my YouTube for replays, but the problem is I only upload the Sun Moon games and some of the XY slash Auras. Like, I don't really upload DPP or Black and White because I don't really like have the. We knowledge. don't know how to narrate that very <laughs> well. Let's put it at that. He said, I passed the baton to Ricardo. So, yeah, with that said, I say thanks to my guest T, and we'll see you with the match, with the gold match in like 20 or 30 minutes. And we out. Gang.